Good morning and welcome to Vlogtober Day 19 and as you can see I'm at work and it's pouring down with rain outside <laughs> which is not very nice and um, weather certainly changed hasn't it anyhow I'm just about to make myself a nice cup of tea because I've just got in and I think I'm going to start off with the machine embroidery for Adele get her another four green frogs and six rainbow ones I think that's everything then then I'll be done then all, all I need is stuffing and the bottom stitching up so that'll keep her happy because <laughs> her convention is fast approaching the first one's on the 31st of this month so, yeah, so I think she's in Manchester um, but other than that I don't really know what today's going to bring <laughs> I'll just have to wait and see and I've managed to get Adele's frogs finished four green ones and turned I haven't cut out these yet because I want to get on some more embroidery which I'm sure you can hear the machine chugging away in the background I've just put some freestanding lace stockings on and they're really cute when they come out so that's going to take 167 minutes <laughs> so they might just finish before I go home today but we'll see I've only just started uh, it's now what half 12 so I'm about to sit down and have some lunch I've just made a nice cup of tea I've got a cheese and ham roll today which is, will be nice um, and I've got my knitting out now I'm glad I brought it <laughs> I haven't really got much to do <laughs> so I'll uh, catch you a little bit later Well, I've just got back in from work. I don't know about you, but the weather here, it's, it's going to be so warm today. I mean, it's still dull and horrible out there and threatening to rain, but it's so warm. <laughs> Anyhow, after I finished work today, um, Adele came down because she was going to the post office and we needed to pop to the charity shop because it's our Halloween party this weekend and all the grandkids have picked what they want to be. And one of the granddaughters wants to be an anime character. That's all I can tell you. So it's like a pleated skirt, um, a baggy cream cardigan with like a sailor's collar on. So I need to make a sailor's collar now for her. Um, but we've managed to pick up a wig. Whether we can do anything with it because it's one of these that sort of shaped at the front, I think, and got like buns. <laughs> I don't know how we're going to manage that, but... I'm sure Adele might come up with something. Um, yeah, so we've got that. So hopefully it'll just be a case of fitting it to her on Saturday ready for the party. <laughs> so that should be fun. We've got lots of games planned for them and all sorts. And also we went to a second charity shop and I was just happened to spot this. How cute is that? And that will fit perfectly. There's no spoon with it, but that will fit perfectly with my um, tear tray theme for the summer. And I'd been looking on eBay oh earlier on in the year for something like this, and they were going for about twelve, anything from twelve pound to twenty five pound. Now I don't know if they've got you know like a special name on them or something that made them expensive, but I mean this hasn't got anything on it. This is just yeah there's nothing on there <laughs> but i'm not bothered about that that's not what i want it for but that will be lovely on my tear tray and if i want to use it i can do all i need is a little spoon <laughs> but yeah that's the front that's the back so i've just washed it all and i'm going to get some bubble wrap out now and wrap it up and put it away in my box ready for next year just pop it there so I don't knock it off. <laughs> Anyhow, while I was at work today, I had a delivery. Fabrics are starting to come in now. Like I said before, some of these fabrics have been ordered like last December. <laughs> so they are starting to come in. And I've actually got three lots of jersey that came in today, which was nice. I 
I've totally forgotten about it. So this is hedgehogs. So it, it is a pinky background. I think it's coming up true to colour. And the hedgehogs, I don't know, she's sniffing a flower by the looks of it. Yeah, she is. But that's really nice. And this is perfect for t-shirts. It's got like a four-way stretch on it. So that'll be perfect for t-shirts. I can't tell you how wide it is because I'm I'm not sure. I need to look at the uh, my invoice. And then the next one, and I've been waiting for this for ages because every time I've tried to get it, it's been out of stock. It's Lego jersey. That is brilliant. I love that. I think that will make some nice cat bandanas. <laughs> Why not? So yeah, well, that's and hopefully I will get these on the website today or tomorrow. I just need to get on the table quick now before I don't need it. And the next one, which I've been waiting for as well, and it's always out of stock, are sprinkles. And they've all got a four-way stretch. Perfect for t-shirts, pyjamas or anything like that. And cat bandanas. <laughs> and they're not just for kids. These are for adults as well. It's very popular. <laughs> right, well, I think I'm going to go and have a cup of tea now because, like I say, we've just got in. And I've actually been knitting at the shop. Now, I, I think I did show her a bit earlier on the machine embroidering some red stockings but it's not finished embroidering um so i've had to leave it so i've turned it off and when i go in tomorrow it'll come back to where it finished off today and it'll continue so i will share the finished stockings tomorrow <laughs> so they do take a while to do um and what i'm doing tonight i might I've got some material for my new bag and you can just see it at the back there <laughs> so if I've got time I might stitch that out again and then decide what I'm going to do with it over the next day or so and then I can share with you when I've decided um I've been doing a bit of knitting as well I haven't got it with me to show you now do you think I'm on target do you think I have managed to do or I'm on target for getting the two heel flaps done and the heel turn sock one is finished i've done that sock two i'm actually on the heel turn i think i'm halfway i think i've got another seven rows to do which i'm actually going to go and do that now so i will have finished that little bit tonight so that is good I might not do any more knitting though tonight. I might leave that for tomorrow and continue with something else. So I will see you all a little bit later on. And we've just had tea. It's getting a bit late. And uh, what did we have? Oh, I had mushy peas and a nice fish cake. It was actually quite big. Uh, I got them from Asda in my shop last week. Uh, Kevin and Jake had croquettes and they had fish with their for their tea uh, so yeah it was really nice i'm, I'm quite full now uh, i did have a glass of rhubarb juice <laughs> uh, i thought i'd better have it with my tea rather than a bit later on <laughs> otherwise i'll be falling asleep <laughs> anyhow i had intended on coming back out here to do a bit of sewing on my uh, hexagons for my autumn frame but i couldn't find all my hexes now i've rolled it up in some wadding and I remember putting it in my handbag last week and taking it to work taking it and taking it out of my bag and I'm thinking well what have I done with it <laughs> I've looked everywhere couldn't find it went upstairs in the bedroom and there was this bit of body <laughs> sat on the side so all my hexes are in there so as it's getting a little bit late now and <clears throat> it's quarter to nine I'm not going to do that tonight. What I'm going to do is unroll it, <laughs> give it a press uh, and maybe do some this week. Trouble is I'm not sure if I'm going to have time now because I've got to do costumes for the kids. <laughs> so I've got to do that. Uh, yeah. So I need to bring some pink fabric up from the shop to do a scary Peppa Pig dress. <laughs> uh, I've ordered the nose and the ears the internet 
so they should be coming soon um what else oh and i've got to do dracula's cape and that's going to be just a simple one i think um nothing too complicated because i don't have a lot of time <laughs> oh, i don't know and yeah, i have been cutting out some some bags i've cut out some fabrics here some of the nice autumn ones um i just need to get some lining i just need to get some wadding um i like to use quilting wadding and i also like to use the fusible fleece but i haven't got any fusible fleece i've been waiting for it to come in stock and it's my supplier seems to be out of stock but i'm seeing the rep tomorrow so i'll have a word with him then and see if we can find out when it's coming in because i, I like that and i'm running low on um wadding as well <laughs> so i need to sort that out and i've run out of uh, labels for my bag so i need to sort that out so i'm gonna have to go shopping again um but i do know i've got some more fabric coming in whether it'll be in this week or not i don't know because this company seems to be quite slow at posting now i've just paid for it today um so it might not be until next week but we'll, we'll see we'll see I think it's a bit more for children, this one. Yeah. And I have put the um go on. Jersey fabrics. They're all set in my draft section on Etsy. All I've got to do is sort the postage out, then they can go live. So maybe by the time this vlog's gone live the Etsy part will be live as well. Uh I didn't bring my socks out with me to show you, neither did I. I've got a brain like a, well, memory like a sieve at the minute, I tell you. <laughs> oh, death, it's too much going off, I think that's what it is. Um, I don't know if I mentioned it before, but I I did pick up the stitches on one sock ready for the gusset. And I really would like to do some knitting now. So I think I might do that and I might watch... Uh, a couple of vlogs or something on Netflix while I'm waiting for my video to export and do everything. So that shall keep me busy for a bit. I think I could do with an early night tonight though, really. Shower, hair uh, wash, I think, tonight. A bit of an early night. And I shall be uh, fighting fit tomorrow. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, thank you for joining me today. I hope everybody's had a good day. I hope you managed to get some crafting done today. And I'll be back at the shop tomorrow and be finishing off the Christmas um, lace stockings, which I'm looking forward to getting them done. And then they will go in my Etsy shop, my new Etsy shop. <laughs> uh, and then I'm going to have a go at doing some gingerbread people, I think. I was looking on the computer for this machine and I've got nothing for this machine for gingerbread because everything is for the genome and not for this one and I think all the original files are on the external hard drive somewhere and I, I don't know what I've done with it so <laughs> I just forget about it because I don't use it very often this external hard drive I've, I've got two and the one with all the designs on for the embroidery machine all the ones that I had sort of over the last five years six years um, are on there I need to find it because I want to do some gingerbread people and I've got a nice gingerbread house to do as well so I want to get some of them done this week but like I say I've got to do kids costumes first that's important and bake cakes and other things <laughs> ready for this party on Saturday so I will see you all again tomorrow for day 20 see what tomorrow brings bye for now